The rosary is like a prayerful meditation on the life of our Lord Jesus Christ. And we know that meditation requires time because it's like basking in the glory of the Lord. So we will be enlightened, inspired, and fortified in our faith life. According to Psalm chapter 19, verse 14, May these words of my mouth and this meditation of my heart be pleasing in your sight, Lord, my rock and my redeemer. So when we pray the rosary, we utter the prayers meditatively so we will be united with God. Sabi nga sa kantang, Sana'y wala ng wakas hanggang ang himig mo maging himig ko na rin. Until God's word will become our words as well, His life will be our life as well. Kaya kinakailangan ang time team na pagbibigkas ng mga kataga at hindi minamadali. In other words, hindi niraratsada. Prayer is communicating with God. It is like spending time with our loved one. And we waste time to get to know our loved one. We devote all our energies to prove our love. And we try to communicate as clearly as possible what is in our hearts. Kaya kapag tayo ay nagdarasan ng Santo Rosario, dapat pinibigyan natin ng tamang respeto at atensyon upang may pahayag natin ang ating pag-ibig, pagtatangi at pagsamba sa Diyos nating mahal. Sa pamamagitan ng mga dasal na itinuro ng ating Panginoong Heso Kristo mismo at ng mga dasal tungkol sa ating mahal na ina na si Santa Maria. Let's humbly offer our praying of the rosary meditatively, wholeheartedly, and lovingly. If you have any other questions for me, you may send them anonymously by clicking the link on this post. Thank you.